Hey guys, it's Josh. It's been a while since my last YouTube video. Sorry for not uploading a video but in a while, but yeah. But you guys got a video like three weeks ago. Uh, so I'm just coming here to talk to you today that I got I don't have any more videos left to talk about. So I've decided to quit YouTube. So see ya. Whoa. Well I guess I have something to talk about now. Okay, hey guys, so we're back here again, talking about random stuff as we usually do. Ah, so today, what are we going to do? Today, what we're going to be talking about is this. So today I went out with my family to the mall and I decided to stop by EB Games to check out what stuff they had. And I saw something that caught my eye. So without further ado, I bought... Sorry. Sorry, upside down. I bought Persona 4 Ultimate, Persona 4 Arena Ultimax for the PlayStation 3 with some extra goodies inside. And along with that, I also got a, one of these EB Games Edge cards. And if you're American, EB Games is basically GameStop here in Canada. Getting one of these cards is pretty easy. All you have to do is sell your solo GameStop or EB Games if you're Canadian. And then you can get ripped off when you trade all your games in. Because, why not? But Persona 4 Arena Ultimax. What is it, Josh? Well, Persona 4 Arena Ultimax is a fighting game, a fighting spin-off game based off Persona 4 for PlayStation 2, placed, um, PSN, and PS Vita. Well, actually, for PS Vita, it's Persona 4 Golden. You know what? Getting myself confused. So... It's a spin-off game of Persona 4, that's all you need to know, guys. And if you're in tune with the Persona lore, you'll know that this game takes place um, a few months after the events of Persona 4, which I won't spoil for you guys if you haven't played it. And by the way, you should all play this game, like, right now. Stop watching this video. Go play Persona 4. Seriously. In any case, if you have played Persona, then I guess you can watch this unboxing video. So, let me get Mr. Butterknife over here. <laughs> And we'll open this up. So, here, as you guys know from my last unboxing video, I'm pretty terrible with unboxings. You, okay, I just used a knife by holding the blade. Okay, kids, don't do this. Kids, don't do this at home. Okay, do not follow what I'm doing. Do not hold knife by the blade. Anyways, open the plastic wrap. Here is the. Okay, so I finally got the game out. Here it is. Uh, I'll show you that guys at last, right? Because that's what the main attraction is or whatever. So the first thing we have here is a set of tarot cards from Persona 4. Or, well, for the Persona series in general. If you guys don't know, these cards are basically used to summon the giant monsters they call personas in the game. And it's pretty awesome. So let me just show this off to you guys. Uh, can open this package. So these tarot cards here represent different arcanas or different groups of personas that you can fight with. Because in the game you can summon different Types of arcanas. Think of like think of it as like Pokemon. There's different types typings. So this is like the fool. This is like the main character's card. And magician, and then, like they're super glossy. I'm sorry if they're like blinding you guys right now. Uh, I don't know what this one is. I don't know what this one is. Sorry, I forget. But you get. I'm just gonna go really fast through all of them so you can see it. That's the lover's arcana. Uh, that's the potato. This is justice. Uh, I don't remember. And I don't remember. I'm a terrible Persona fan, guys. Um, you know what? Instead of telling you what it is, I'll keep it a surprise. What you should know is that you have to blow in here. Okay, that sounds wrong. I'm sorry. Anyways, you have to blow it up. That's that. You have to blow it up. Don't think about it like that. <laughs> Anyways, it requires a lot of oxygen. Oh, God. You know what? I'm just going to do this off screen. 
Okay guys, here's a different angle that you guys don't normally get, but whatever. So here's the teddy thingy-majiggy, and we're gonna put them over here, and you guys are gonna face this way, and look at all of the stuff on my ground, on the ground and whatnot, and we're gonna look at how you use this thing. So ready? Three, one, there, we're done. You guys might have thought that was exceptionally violent, but you don't know how much oxygen that took to blow up that thing. <sighs> so, moving on. Last but not least is the actual game itself. Teddy, get out of here! Oh, God. Sorry about that, guys. So, last but not least is the actual game itself. Um, like I said before, I'm not too much into fighting games, but it's Persona, so I have to play it. Oh my God. That is awesome. Just look at this disc. It is freaking awesome. If you're a Persona fan, or for specifically a Persona 4 or a 3 fan, then I definitely suggest buying this game. It is just so awesome. I mean, look at all the stuff you get too. I am like literally fanboying over all of this. Even the Teddy Punching Bag. Oh God, I really hope he doesn't come back in any more of these videos for today guys i don't have much else to talk about other than that um one more thing um after my exams in two weeks you can expect a manga update video because i haven't done one of those in a while and if you look look at the back there i actually have been collecting a lot of stuff <sighs> so um don't know how to conclude this so i'll just say i'll see you later peace